Hey guys, what's up? This is Blaze the Movie Fan, and tomorrow I'm going to an airport, to an airplane that leaves to Boston. But before I go, there is one more video that I have to make to clear something up. Hopefully this will be the final disclosure to the subject of my videos about dreams. I have a lot to say, so without further ado, let's get started. Remember in 2010 when Amskolo One made that video titled The Pokemon World is Not Funny? Well, when I re-uploaded it to my channel in 2013, it got falsely flagged. And when I did a counterclaim notice earlier this year, it got declined. And I'm gonna explain why I think the flaking was for false reasons. I mean, yes, Amskolo One did make fun of my country, Iceland. But the thing about it is, it was just a fucking joke. A lot of what he said in that video were fucking jokes that shouldn't be taken seriously. But the main message of the video was 100% accurate. Thinking about real life is far more important than thinking about dreams. And I realize that now. That's the main reason why I no longer make these videos. Making all those videos about my dreams was extremely fucking stupid of me and I'm glad I don't do it anymore. People even thought I was a troll back then and I wasn't a troll, at least not intentionally. But considering my actions in 2010, I can hardly blame them. The main reason why I stopped making those videos is because they take absolutely no fucking effort. I mean, anybody can make videos talking about their dreams, but there's a damn good reason why I'm... Not subscribe to too many people that do. Because dreams are completely nonsensical. I'm sorry, but it's true. Almost nothing in dreams makes sense. And if you base your arguments only on stuff you find in your dreams, you will in return make very ignorant points. I never should have made those fucking videos in the first place. I know a lot of people enjoy these videos and are wondering why I don't make them anymore. That's why I made this video. The real point of dreams is to inspire people to do something in their lives. They are not there so we can base your entire fucking lifestyle off them. Now not all dreams are like that, but those that really do have bad messages are dreams worth ignoring just they aren't worth anyone's time. Also, if you're worried that I'm going to delete those videos, don't worry, I won't do that because I know many people like them and also had legitimately good reasons to like them. But there is one thing that I will do instead. I'm going to move them over to my archive channel because I don't want them to be part of my main channel anymore. For those of you who desperately want those videos back, let me ask you a question. Wouldn't you rather see what happens in my dreams instead of me telling you all about it? If I tell you about my dreams, you would have to use your own fucking imagination to see how it was like. And I'm the one that should put effort into shit like that, not you.
I mean, really think about it. The videos that are full of stupid nonsense are the videos that most of my subscribers like to watch. And you know what? I will be making a lot more of these videos in the future. In fact, the Inside the Mertier series will be updated a lot more frequently now. You will see. Just don't expect those videos to be made every week because it takes a lot of time. So anyway, yeah, I hope I cleared things up in this video. If not, feel free to ask me stuff. I'm sorry to say, but as of now, I'm never going back to making videos talking about my dreams. People that thought I needed help back in 2010 were absolutely right. I really did need fucking help. And I should, by all rights, have kept my dreams private. And that's exactly what I'm doing with most of the dreams that I get nowadays. So, yeah, that's all I've got to say, people. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.